in line with the provisions enshrined in the Armed Forces Act, Cap A20, the laws of the Federation 2004, Part 7 Administration, Government and Command Section 18124, the newly appointed Acting Chief of Army Staff, Major General Olufemi Olatsubosu Oluyede, has assumed command today. The formal taking over ceremony at the Defence Headquarters Abuja presided over a battle chief of Defence Staff, General Christopher Gwambi Musa, has in attendance representative of the Chief of Naval Staff and the Chief of the Air Staff, the Chief of Defence Intelligence, the Chief of Policy and Plans Army, the Departmental Chiefs, the Director General of Defence Development, the Chief of Defence Space Administration, Directors from Defence Headquarters and the Nigerian Army, Senior Officers from the Three Services. The newly appointed Acting Chief of Army Staff, Major General Olufemi Olatobosun Oluyede, sought for Senior Officers and Nigerian Army personnel support and cooperation to succeed together in stemming all forms of insecurity currently be witnessed across the country and return the country to land of peace and economic prosperity. Mr. President, for finding me worthy to discharge this responsibility as the acting chief of army staff in this particular, peculiar, and sober situation, we find ourselves as a nation as an army. As highlighted by the presidency in the announcement, my appointment as acting chief of army staff is simply to hold sway why Lieutenant General Chief Abuja, our Medical Chief of Army Staff, is a way to enable him to take sufficient time to get necessary medical attention and recuperate. And that I intend to do with the whole of my heart and loyalty to the Constitution, as well as Mr. President, and by extension to my leader, Lieutenant General Chief Abuja, that I have been mandated to stand in for. As we journey through this unique period, I request that we all continue to pray for General Agoja's speedy recovery and safe return to complete the excellent job we have started. Furthermore, I seek everyone's support and cooperation so that we can succeed together in stemming all forms of insecurity currently being witnessed across the country and return this our beautiful country to the land of peace and economic prosperity. Well, this is not a speech-making occasion, and therefore, I will just wrap up by pledging my honor like the artist is concerned of the President of Nigeria and my appointing authority in the person of Mr. President and Commander-in-Chief of the Armed Forces of Nigeria, President Bola Ahmed Tinubu. Long live the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Lord live the Nigerian Army. In his remarks, the Chief of the Defense Staff, General Christopher Agwabe Musa, noted that Major General Olufemi Oluyede's selection was based on his vast knowledge of military leadership at all levels, character and competence. We are to note that your selection was based on your vast knowledge of military leadership at all levels, character and competence. You are a member of a larger team of professional soldiers who are saddled with the responsibility of defending the territorial integrity of the Federal Republic of Nigeria by land, sea and air as captured in our constitution. It is therefore expected of you to consolidate and improve on the course of the substantive chief of army staff, Lieutenant General T. Lagwaja, as well as past chief of army staff, in order to sustain the high level of professionalism, discipline, resilience, and regimentation that the Nigerian army is known for, for all, all over the world. While I congratulate you on your appointment, I implore you not to rest on your oars in ensuring that you justify the confidence reposed on you by the president, commander in chief. Spite of the news report that the former handover ceremony was presided over by the Chief of Defense Staff, General Christopher Gwabi Musa, who formally handed over the Army Command flag to the Acting Chief of Army Staff. It will be recalled that President Bola Ahmed Tunubu announced the appointment of Major General Oluyede as the Acting Chief of Army Staff, pending the return of the substantive Chief of Army Staff, Lieutenant General Tarid Ladbeja, who is undergoing treatment abroad. Until his appointment, Major General Olufemi Oluyere served as the 56th Commander of the Infantry Corps of the Nigerian Army in Jaji, Kaduna. 
and is a member of 39th Regular Combat Course of the Nigerian Defense Academy, Olayemi Esun, Plus TV.